afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News. I'm Melissa, and this is my co-host, Kyra. Thanks for joining us today. I heard some of the math classes had a pie party before we left for spring break. I heard they all had a really good time. Here's more on the story. Hi, Ms. Stevenson here with... Courtney. Courtney wants to know why I'm celebrating Pi Day in my math class. So, let me tell you a little bit about it. I got the idea from Miss Teekle. She uh, celebrates Pi Day every year, and she does it the Friday before spring break. So, I decided to piggyback off that idea, and we're doing that as well. So, you can kind of look around. What my students are doing is they are measuring pies. They have pies of every size and different components, and they're dabbing too but um, pies of different sizes and different components. And they're figuring out the radius, diameter, circumference, and area of those pies. How much of pie do I know? I don't have to memorize that. I'm a teacher. <laughs> I know, 3.14. What's your favorite kind of pie? My favorite kind of pie? I don't know, I've had a lot of pie today. My favorite kind? I don't know, what's your favorite kind? Chocolate. Chocolate, okay, so I did have a chocolate pie today that was really good. I also had a banana cream that was outstanding. And do you guys know Kennedy Norkowitz? Oh my goodness, Kennedy brought a homemade apple pie. That was the bomb. It was really, really good. So, I don't know, I like a lot of pies. I mean, I don't, I don't know if I have a favorite pie, but I like pie. Pie was good, it was good, it was a fun, it's a fun way to celebrate. Mathematics in the real world and, and, and pie. So anyway, that was it. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, I'm Courtney here with Kaylee. The camera bag. John. How much of pie do you know? Uh, 3.1415, that's all I know. 3.1415192653589793248468. How much of pie do you actually know without the bag? Without the Actually, I know. 3.14. Uh, 3.14.1415926534626423. Uh, what's after 43? Thank you. Turning to other news, tomorrow is iPod Day. Bring a couple of extra dollars so you can buy a ticket and listen to music in class. You're not going to want to miss out. Our first star tests are next week. Seventh graders will take part one of their writing test Tuesday, while eighth graders take their math test. The eighth graders will take their reading test next Wednesday. Let's all study hard and get plenty of rest this weekend. And get ready to do your best on the star test. Also, plan to buy an eighth grade banquet ticket this week. If you buy them today or tomorrow, they'll only cost you 20 bucks. If you wait until later, they'll cost you 25. So buy them now and save yourself a few dollars. And don't forget to get an application for one of the next year's elective classes. You can pick up a broadcast applications in room 706. You can pick up yearbook applications in 503 and art applications can be picked up in room 109. And library applications can be picked up from Ms. Ammons. All applications need to be filled out and turned in really soon. So make sure you get her done. Now let's check in with Tornado Blocado and see what's going on in our weather. I'm Tornado Blocado here with your weather today. Today's conditions, partly cloudy, 72 degrees, wind south 20 miles per hour, precipitation 20%. Tonight's regional forecast could have some rain in our area, a mix of snow and rain in this area. Our fabulous five-day forecast, cooler tomorrow with no chance of rain, warming up the next few days after that. I'm Tornado Blocado, back to you. Thanks, Tornado Blocado. Now let's find out what's going on in sports. Hello, FMS sports fans. I'm Gracie, and this is Matthew. Here's a look at today's sports. The next track meet of the year is today. Everyone's been working extra hard and getting ready for the big showdown. Check it out. I'm Presley here with... Samantha. Annika. What events will you be a part of at the next track meet? The 800. Long jump. What school will give you the most competition this year? Heritage. Heritage. What do you enjoy most about track? Mm, running with my friends. Um, an excuse for my mom to bring me food. Thank you. Uh, oh. <laughs> I'm Presley. Rika. Cambridge. What events will you be a part of at the next track meet? 
<laughs> the 800. <laughs> the 100 and 300 hurdles. What school will give you the most competition this year? None. Heritage. What do you enjoy most about track? Running with Rika. Running with Cambry. The boys will be here while the girls are at Estacado. It starts at 5. Good luck, Tigers. The first golf tourney of the year takes place this weekend. Members of the Tiger team will travel to Snyder this Saturday. Members of the Tiger team will travel to Snyder this Saturday for a day of fun in the sun. We know they're looking forward to the trip. Do your best. That's a look at today's sports. Back to you. Well, that's all we have today. And thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye.